hi everybody uh, today we are here to discuss one of the important queries which come on the social media regarding sudden death during the exercise and people come in my clinic and they ask from me sir if i am going to do exercise whether i am going to die or not the second how much exercise i should do and these two queries sometime give me a lot of uh, uh, queries uh, uh, i just want to address in this uh, presentation how to go ahead means whether exercise is good or not so let me introduce myself first i am dr ashutosh i am an interventional cardiology come electrophysiologist but this is one part my professional part but i still run and run like anything i every, i run every day around 7 kilometers in my whatever schedule and if you can see this is my own uh, marathon record that i have done in 2021 and i have run for almost 4 uh, hour 55 minutes to complete 42 kilometers so with all those experiences and this habit what you call running habit has make a lot of difference and just i want to share if you really want to live in this world on this earth running exercise or any extra curricular activity like jogging swimming you have to take because whenever you are doing exercise you are doing something very great for your body that is the basic minimum if you are healthy you are doing a health investment for the future if you are having disease means if you are having diabetes hypertension if you are having any of the illnesses no doubt exercise is a one of the pill which is going to reduce your other pills of your medicines so never underestimate that if you are doing exercise it is not going to add on anything it is one of the most important pill that people uh, don't understand they don't want to take it because it is somewhat you have to motivate yourself so exercise how it works so when you are doing exercise you are you are with yourself number one second thing when you are exercising there are changes happen in the body your circulatory system is one of the uh, one of the important part which take the nourishment for all the organs that is in the booster phase means it is nourishing all the muscles internal organs and one important uh, hormone or you can say the substance is released what we call irisin which is which, which we call as a uh, exercise hormone and this is one of the important uh, constituent or you can say important substance which is been released in the blood which convert the yellow fat to the brown fat and you know brown fat is a very good thing for the internal organs so whenever it is increasing it is increasing your efficiency also it is protecting your internal organs also and on top when you are doing the exercise a lot of changes happen starting from the bone the bone density increases over time if you are going to the brain your memory and the, there is a release of brain derived neurotrophic factors which nourishes the brain coming to the pancreas there is a release of uh, the, the beta cell uh, function improve if you are going into the immune system your immunity will built up the inflammation will uh, level will reduce so whenever you are exercising you are nourishing these type of uh, these all organs which you can't do by any other means so exercise is a pill if you are taking every day you are protecting the myth that exercising kills the uh, kills the person and a lot of uh, news comes that particular celebrity was exercising he died but one question i just asked from the person who is reporting or who is bringing this on the public domain why he died on that particular day not before because he is exercising for almost maybe a decade or maybe for years not died before only on that particular day so that gives the real reason if somebody has to die he has he may be having some reason we should not give the reasoning that exercise has killed him it was a time that he has developed the particular problem and he has died and there are a lot of things which may culminate in the death so where if i am sitting on the chair and if i die i should not give a reason that the chair as the killer or the sitting on the chair is a killing we have to go and in, in investigate and we have to reach up to the post mortem before making any conclusions so if any celebrity has died in the gym it may be a reason that that particular time he has 
sustained some some sort of cardiac or non cardiac reason and he has died and it needs a thorough ev evaluation before labeling that exercise kills if you are asking exercise kills there are some conditions which as a electrophysiologist as a sudden and uh, cardiac death specialist i want to share with you there are some condition like uh, we call as a arvd there are some arrhythmia arid we call as a uh, 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 ventricular tachycardia polymorphic vts which will happen when you are doing exercise and we investigate the patient there are some conditions for which there are some ecg findings there are eco finding on will be uh, in which we make a conclusion that you are having some heart problem if you are doing exercise you may develop syncope you may develop giddiness you may develop sometime cardiac arrest so those conditions patient will be uh, uh, will be given the advice that that they should not do the any physical activity particular type which is going to uh, incite that particular of arrhythmia or uh, this type of events so those condition has to be diagnosed before uh, saying that ex if you are doing exercise you are going to die so let us be clear exercise adds life in years in the life and if you are Uh, doing exercise you are adding time in your uh, lifetime means it is the way that you are going you are going to become more efficient the work what you are doing in 3 hours it may be possible that you are going to make it 1 hours so that it is one of the most important time management tool if you are using exercise it is a future investment it is a pill reducer medicines or you can say pill reducer pill that if you are taking every day it is going to make in that and finally exercise is must for everybody unless you are diagnosed with a condition where you should not and that your card uh, that your cardiologist will certainly say that you are having that particular condition you should avoid exercise or the physical activity because it will incite the arrhythmia it will incite that particular disease with the, uh, this information i am uh, signing off next time we will meet with some other conditions